It's Ruben Jay here at The Voice semifinale with Zach Seaball, Seba, right? Seaball. Seaball. It's weird. I, it's I think weird. I pronounce it weird, different every time. It's a weird name. Uh, you did Miley Cyrus's The Climb. And uh, I just got to ask you, especially because it's, it's, it's definitely it's a female song. It was written from a female yeah. perspective. Uh, what perspective do you take that song from? You know, I just think of the lyrics and the message that I'm, you know, I'm trying to deliver to such a big audience because I think everyone watching um, can relate to that message because um, you know everybody has a dream and everyone knows that you know you're not it's not, it's not just gonna be handed to you um, and at this point in the competition to have had a song like that I and mean, to be able to deliver it like that um, it was awesome and being you know really the first male that's ever co ever covered a song like that or that specific song um, it was really cool and I'm glad to have had Blake there in my corner now Last week you, you were like all elvis -y and like you dance all over the place. I, did you do an Elvis song last week? Um, it was a tribute to Elvis. Tribute to it elvis. was a Queen song. Queen song. So, okay, so, yeah. And it was just incredible. And then tonight you, you just you stripped it down. You became more of a front man. Uh, what, what can we see from you, you know, uh, at your show? Like, what, what type of, of style do you want to portray more? I think everything that you've seen on the show is something that I want to incorporate into all my shows and all my albums. Um, every single song that I've sung is really, you know, I think shown America the kind of artist that I want to be. Um, and it's nice to have that versatility. I would love to see you actually dance with the guitar. Do a little yeah, bit of I haven't. That's the only thing to do. I haven't tried that yet. We have, you know, we only have a week to prepare for a song, so adding that guitar and dancing at the same time, I'll, right maybe I'll save it for the finale. Yeah, so, there you go. Yeah, we'll uh, now I do have to ask you, uh, there are a lot of. Uh, older women who watch the show. And I don't know if you saw my tweet recently, but uh, one one lady in particular calls you a cougar magnet. Now, okay, going out there and, and dancing like that and doing that thing, are you are you trying to feed that cougar, the cougar power? <laughs> I'm really just being myself on stage. <laughs> um, you know, I love to move, and you know, the music's just in, in my soul, and and I love that. And you know, for, for the girls to recognize me like that, um, it's really, really cool, so. <laughs> okay, last question. Obviously, uh, tomorrow night, five people are going home. Five people going home. Next week, everyone goes home. Yep. Uh, if you have a chance to perform any song that you want to perform without any producers or Blake getting involved, what song is that? Oh, Lord. I don't know. Love to, love to throw in a little Elvis Presley, so. Which, which one? I don't know. A jailhouse? <laughs> Jail, in all honesty, that would be the most fun. Yeah. Um, just because it's a lot of dancing. You doing so. that the most. Yeah, that'd be a lot of fun. So we'll okay. go with Jail Hot Shot. Right. <laughs> well, it's Ruben Jay here at The Voice, semi finale with Jack Seaball. Make sure to vote. Did I say it right this time? Yep, Seaball. Right. <laughs> yep. Make sure to vote for him, like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time.